Dave Myers has brought laughter and joy into homes across Britain for decades as one half of the beloved Harry Bikers duo. But in 2022, the star received earth-shattering news that left fans stunned. He'd been diagnosed with cancer. What followed was a grueling battle against the disease that pushed both his body and spirit to the breaking point. Join Facts First as we delve into his emotional cancer ordeal, the support that has sustained him, and why his courage leaves admirers in tears of hope. Dave's Emotional Cancer Journey From the moment Dave Myers was diagnosed with cancer in May of 2022, it set off a grueling and emotional ordeal. Doctors prescribed an intensive course of over 30 chemotherapy sessions in the hopes of beating the insidious disease. But the treatment took a tremendous physical and mental toll on the beloved TV chef. While eager to commence the fight to save his life, Dave had no idea just how brutal the treatment would be. Within weeks, he lost the thick mane of hair that had become synonymous with his hairy biker's persona. But it was far more than a superficial change. The chemo was assaulting his body. Dave collapsed in exhaustion as the poison targeted his fast-dividing cells. Nausea became a constant battle as Dave's appetite vanished despite being a self-proclaimed glutton. Food held no pleasure as his sense of taste was stripped away. He experienced sharp pains throughout his weakened body, while personal cares, like keeping his usual neat appearance, became a struggle, without hair and eyelashes. The grueling sessions also left him disoriented and unsteady on his feet. As the weeks dragged on, his weight plummeted in his diminished state. Even the simplest tasks required Herculean effort from Dave's depleted reserves. He broke down in tears, seeing his appearance morph before his eyes and feeling like a shell of his former energetic self. Dark thoughts crept in about mortality and an uncertain future against the disease. Support from loved ones provided rays of hope, but there were still countless nights coping with agony, loneliness, and fear that left him inconsolable. Finding Comfort in Cooking As Dave Myers's grueling chemotherapy treatments dragged on, he found a small glimmer of light during his darkest hours. A Filipino nurse took compassion on Dave and brought him a comforting bowl of pancit noodles to lift his spirits. Though his appetite was diminished, Dave devoured every bite of the comforting dish. Its warmth and flavor provided unexpected joy in his time of need. This act of kindness planted a seed in Dave's mind. His love of food ran deep, even if his body was rejecting it now. As he continued battling his illness, an idea began to take shape. Dave decided to channel his passion and document his cancer journey into a creative project by writing a new cookbook with his longtime friend and co-star, Cy King. Plunging into the project gave Dave a renewed sense of purpose during his treatment. Recalling recipes that had charmed him in the past became a ray of normalcy. Consulting with Cy over video calls brought smiles as they swapped cooking tips and memories. But the book also allowed Dave to honor those who were helping him fight each day. One recipe in particular held special meaning, the comforting pancit noodles from his Filipino nurse. Its simplicity and coziness reminded Dave of her kindness. Including the recipe felt like a small way to pay tribute to those lighting the way during his darkest hours. As he researched and tested it, Dave was transported back to feeling nourished in both body and spirit. The rigors of chemotherapy had begun to separate Dave from his beloved relationship with food. But working on the cookbook started to slowly heal that connection. By the time it was completed, writing had reignited Dave's passion and strengthened his bond with Cy during the tough times. The Difficult Road to Recovery Even with chemotherapy complete, Dave Myers faced numerous challenges on the long road to recovery. The treatments had taken a tremendous toll physically, and regaining his former strength seemed a monumental battle. But perhaps most concerning was the impact the drugs had on his balance and mobility. From almost the first session, Dave noticed effects beyond hair loss and nausea. His equilibrium was thrown off, and even simple tasks like getting dressed left him disoriented. Walking became an unsteady ordeal, and on bad days, even standing up was a struggle. Fighting off infection with a compromised immune system requires spending more time resting, but it was the loss of independence that wounded Dave's spirit. Completing physiotherapy each day just to relearn basic movements was soul-crushing at times. 
tears of frustration fell as he battled to regain what had once come without effort. Just as with appetite, Dave's weight was another seesawing struggle. Emaciated from months unable to eat, his frame approached frightening levels of thinness. But over time, well-wishers tempting him with nourishing foods packed the pounds back on quickly when his capacity returned. Now, maintaining a stable size required diligent effort. Though making progress, setbacks were invariably discouraging. Relapses in balance emerged that forced starting rehabilitation again from the beginning. It seemed one step forward was always matched by half a step back. But slowly, with the support of loved ones and medical professionals, Dave clawed his way towards healing. He'd come to see recovery as a non-linear journey, much like the unpredictable nature of his illness. As long as he kept putting one foot in front of the other, the destination would come in time. Support from family, friends, and fans As his battle against cancer stretched through grueling treatments and the arduous road to recovery, Dave Myers found solace in the unwavering support around him. None were more steadfast than his wife, who became his rock through turbulent storms. With a caring embrace and her soothing presence, she eased Dave's suffering both physically and emotionally. His decades-long friendship with Cy King also provided rays of hope during even the bleakest moments. Though they couldn't be side-by-side, -side, video calls and message exchanges lifted Dave's spirits. Working together on their cookbook strengthened the bond that made their darkest days brighter. Beyond his closest companions, an outpouring of encouragement from fans filled Dave with motivation as well. Even just receiving scores of well wishes showed the impact he and Cy continue making with their sunny dispositions. Reading positive messages online or hearing from supporters bolstered Dave to keep fighting when willpower wavered. Their kindness convinced him that as long as people still showed interest in his journey, his story wasn't over yet. Looking into the future with hope After a journey few could imagine enduring, Dave Myers emerged from the abyss with a transformed perspective. Though treatment remained ongoing and full recovery lies ahead, he now sees each sunrise with fresh eyes. Progress made since those bleakest days, whether regaining strength or reconnecting with passions, nourish his optimism. Dave feels profoundly grateful simply experiencing normal moments with family he nearly lost. Sharing a meal together or going for a walk remind him of life's profound blessings, not to be taken for granted as before. While support from loved ones and strangers lifted his spirits throughout, their care now radiates as a warm glow within his healing soul. Most of all, Dave hopes sharing his candor offers hope to others in their own darkness. If even one person finds solace from his openness and resilience, the exposure of such private turmoil seems worthwhile. Now it's time to hear from you. How can Dave's story help encourage others currently struggling with illness? Let us know in the comments section below.